When first dealing with the coronavirus, we were navigating new territory. I'm thankful that we were able to work with other nonprofits, such as the Student Advocacy Center, to develop a needs assessment for our families. In these assessments, we asked many sensitive questions, including, are any of the members of your family currently experiencing any virus symptoms? We also asked questions related to food security, housing security, and just what concerns folks had. Because our staff focuses so much on relationships, we were able to have these meaningful conversations with the families in our program. Many of our families do not have access to transportation or rely solely on public transportation. We also have families who have members in their household with a weakened immune system or pre-existing conditions. We have created a schedule to deliver food and supplies weekly to families that either don't have access to transportation or are at a higher health risk and can't leave their houses. Oh, it's a little tough doing checking calls and hearing some people get emotional or um, just hearing what they're going through. So, you know, just trying to help one day at a time. 